breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. Top Nigerian lawyer reviews. What will happen if Buhari should release Unamdekano? Top Nigerian lawyer reviews what will happen if Buhari should release Unamdekano. To my dear listeners, from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read to this news. A member of the legal profession, Monday Ubani claims that President Muhammad Buhari will leave a positive legacy if he complies with the court's instructions and frees Unamdekano, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, who has been declared a terrorist organization. Without having peace in our nation, we will not be able to achieve any development. Therefore, the best thing to do in this situation is to look at this problem from a, from a holistic perspective. Speak to Namdekano and speak to the elders about what steps should be taken to ensure that there is complete and hotter peace. The release of Namdekano is necessary for the preservation of peace in the southeast as well as in the rest of the country in general. On Thursday, Ubani appeared on Channel's television Sunrise Daily program and made the following statement. So, I think that advice should go to the president that at this point in time, he has a very good legacy to leave behind by releasing Unamdekanu, Ubani said. But before then, there should be a discussion as to ensuring peace in the Southeast. After the decision of the appeal court to order Kano's release, the head of the section on public interest and development law of the Nigerian Bar Association, Ubani, stated that the federal government had no cause to continue holding Kano in detention. According to him, the government shouldn't use concerns about the nation's safety as an excuse to disrespect the judicial system. Since June 2021, when he was re-arrested in Kenya by the federal government and brought home to face terrorism, related charges, Kano has been held by the Department of State Services, DSS. He was brought home to face these charges. Kanu was recently ordered to be released by the Court of Appeal. And on Wednesday, the Federal High Court ordered the federal government to return Unamdekano to his status quo before 19th, June 2021. However, the government has not yet complied with either of these court rulings. A member of the legal profession, Monday Ubani claims that President Muhammad Buhari will leave a positive legacy if he complies with the court's instructions and frees Zunam Dekanu. The leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, who has been declared a terrorist organization.
without having peace in our nation, we will not be able to achieve any development. Therefore, the best thing to do in this situation is to look at this problem from a holistic perspective. Speak to Namdi Kanu and speak to the elders about what steps should be taken to ensure that there is complete and utter peace. The release of Namdi Kanu is necessary for the preservation of peace in the southeast as well as in the rest of the country in general. On Thursday, Ubani appeared on Channel's television Sunrise Daily program and made the following statement. So I think that advice should go to the president, that at this point in time, he has a very good legacy to leave behind by releasing Unamdi Kanu. Ubani said, But before then, there should be a discussion as to ensure peace in the Southeast. After the decision of the appeal court to order, re order Kanu's release, the head of the Section on Public Interest and Development Law of the Nigerian Bar Association, Hubani, stated that the federal government had no cause to continue holding Kanu in detention. According to him, the government shouldn't use concerns about the nation's safety as an excuse to disrespect the judicial system. Since June 2021, when he was rearrested in Kenya by the federal government and brought home to face terrorism related charges, Kano has been held by the Department of State Services DSS. He was brought